The WWE Universe with an electric feeling here tonight. We are sold out and raring to go. I am amped up, pumped up, jacked up, and ready to kick things off. What are we waiting for, fellas? Let's watch some fights. I look at this card and my... We have a great matchup coming up next. We have a real fan favorite. these girls who doesn't I don't and accompanied by Billy Kay representing the Iconics from Sydney Australia Peyton Royce <laughs> yeah, I love it. And from Scottsdale, Arizona, Bree Bella. Bree Bella, a, a champion. She's a trailblazer in the women's revolution. She's got two hit television shows. Brie Bella, a billboard example of breaking the glass ceiling and pursuing all of your dreams. Am I the only one that has a problem with the fact that most of Brie Bella's success can be attributed to the fact that she's got an identical twin and they cheat all the time? And here's the lockup. Look at these two jockeying for position. She's starting to put moves together. Watch out. Bella's on the attack now. Oh no, she's in a bad way now. She lands an enormous elbow. The shoulders are down, and she kicks out. She's still in this one. Brie Bella's not looking good here. Well, this one appears far from over, and she knows that. You know, she's the kind of competitor oh, that actually likes getting hit. It motivates her. And this might just be what she needs to put her over the top, believe it or not. At this point, I think it's fair to call into question her preparation for this match. She's clearly being outclassed right now. She's out of it, guys. Yeah, she's leaving herself wide open here.
Back now inside the ring. And she's back in the ring now. Oh, you gotta love Peyton oh, Royce, oh. that spinning leg lariat. She's got a chance to win it here. That's how you keep your opponent off balance, Cole. We're looking at complete domination here. Just carrying the opposition here. But you can't carry your opponent all day. You gotta make a move eventually. Nice job getting out of the way of that one. No, she's too quick for her. Oh man, she is rolling now. Oh, Peyton just took her out with a leg lariat. I bet you feel foolish riding her off now. Escapes trouble there. You gotta think about using the finisher here pretty soon, I would think. Just pick up the win and move on. There's no need to keep this thing going longer than necessary. Brie Bella looking to end this. She's starting to sweat a bit. Kick after kick. Wow, what a gritty performance. But now, can Brie Bella capitalize? You can tell by the look in her eye that Brie Bella is preparing to end this match. Yes, Lock! That's all she wrote, fellas. Nobody survives that, Michael. Good point by Byron earlier. If there's an opening to execute the finisher, you got to take it. The last thing you... She goes for the cover. One, two, gets the shoulder up. We're going to take more than that. We may... Here comes Brie Bella. Looks like she's starting to stumble. Getting it done. Jeez. Breeze looking good here. She's a live wire when she's plucked. Here's her cover. Well, that was a close call. Wow. That's pure power, guys. Bree Bella looking to end this. She's got her now. She can pick up the win here, guys. Is the second time enough to end this match? Bree Bella looking to end this. Breeze looking good here. Talk about a painful move. Saved by the ropes. Talk about being in the right place at the right time. Peyton Royce was able to get out of the way there. Look at her go. Brie Bella able to avoid damage. You have to think that's it. Oh, Brie Bella able to avoid damage. Showing her strength off of that power bomb. When she gets in attack mode, look out. You can tell by the look in her eye that Brie Bella is preparing to end this match right now. What a combination. You just don't know what's coming next. We may be looking at our winner. Here's a cover! Could be it. Two! Well, she's got a tremendous amount of resilience, so I think she's got some something left here. Somehow she's still in this matchup. It's unbelievable. God, King, with this kind of action, I'd like to volunteer to be Brie's sparring partner. Brie Bella looking to end this. Yes, Lock! Man, she knows how to make a comeback. And Brie Bella picks up the win. Here's a few clips from the last match for us. I don't like to throw around a lot of praise, but my eyes tell me that might have been one of the great matches in recent WWE history.
This entire match was just one big highlight reel, and I didn't expect anything else. Here is your winner, Brie Bella. And the first match of the night comes to an end in thrilling fashion. And you just know the rest of the card is watching in the back, wondering how in the world they're going to follow that. What a way to kick off tonight. Don't go anywhere, folks. We're just getting started. Singles action is up next. You're not going to want to miss this. We have one of the best talents on the roster to date, taking on some tough competition. Who will reign supreme? comes the self-proclaimed juvenile delinquent. And from Elmwood Park, New Jersey, Liv Morgan. The firecracker of the riot squad. One of the only good things to ever come out of the state of New Jersey. Jersey tough. There's no doubt about that. Successful career coming in WWE. You can Man. feel the electricity running through this arena. This is going to be some battle, one-on-one, -on -one, mano a mano. And given the athleticism of these women, this one promises to be can't miss. Oh man, right to the R. Hyper extends her elbow. She goes for the cover. She's got a long way to go before she should be thinking about a pinfall victory here. What a kick out. Crusher. Spin kick to the midsection. Leap from. Wow, is there nothing? She the cover. She goes for the cover. We got a cover. Very curious move to go for a pinfall at this point. Not yet. Too early. The damage has been done. That'll have you worrying about long-term injuries for sure. Look at this. She's so dangerous. 
That strike was strategically placed on her opponent. You can see the confidence just beaming from her right now. Super kick! She is just so dominant. The night could be over for Liv Morgan. Looking for the win. That lands. Oh, it's oh. she goes for the cover. She's got some fight left in her. Gonna take a whole lot more. From what we've seen and heard tonight, there must be serious injuries. Things have gotten worse for Liv Morgan. She could be out of this match. It doesn't seem to be her night. She goes for the cover. A oh, quick kick out from Liv Morgan. Just not enough damage done yet, Cole. You've got to think about using the finisher here pretty soon, I would think. Just pick up the win and move on. There's no need to keep this thing going longer than necessary. I think she's trying to prove a point here. Good point by Byron earlier. If there's an opening to execute the finisher, you got to take it. The last thing you want to do is let your opponent hang around for no reason. I can tell you, bad things happen when you do that. If you don't believe me, just go back and watch Skip versus Barry Horowitz from 1995. I remember that like it was yesterday, Cole. Instead of putting Horowitz away, Skip thought it would be a good idea to going for the cover. She is on fire. Too close for cover. He can't let that happen again. I can't believe she kicked out there. Well, she wants this win bad. Wow, she's fought her way all the way back here. Just, she goes for the cover. We may very well be seeing the finisher here very shortly, guys. And when that happens, there's the pin. It's over. It's all over. Now let's take another look at these wonderful women in action. When any superstar, man or woman, is able to find a way to win a match as entertaining and action-filled as that one, they should be grateful and really proud. Some great stuff. From the opening bell, this match was won for the ages. I'm almost speechless. Almost. Here is your winner, Riley! And that's a win to start off the night. And if that matches any indication of what to expect here tonight, we are in for an amazing evening. Believe it or not, that's just the beginning, folks. Stay tuned for more great action. We have a great match coming up next. Let's do it! That strike definitely found its target. When a superstar locks up with Seth Rollins, they must be prepared to endure attacks from all angles. Rollins has perfected oh. the fighting style that's been described as a frantic assault. The best laid plans often go awry, but the architect has always been able to rebuild and redesign. Yeah, but it's that reclaiming part at the end of his saying that Seth Rollins often gets tripped up on. Hits him with the uppercut. Back in the ring again. Yeah. 
simply destroying the back. If you're rooting for Seth Rollins, you have reason to worry now. He came into this match expecting a fight, and that's exactly what he's getting. He just oh, has man. to make sure this doesn't get too out of hand for him. Sometimes, momentum... He's going for the pin. And a kick out, much to nobody's surprise. Nah, not yet. Too early. What strength! And the Cesaro section can't be far behind. Ugh. Cesaro is in position. That shot was perfect. If you get hit with a lot more of those, getting nailed once turns into a full-scale beating. Incredible. Seth Rollins is in trouble. Oh, well, the architect is rolling now. And here we go. Seth Rollins sees his opening. Bam! That could be it, guys. Now that got those shoulders on the mat. And Cesaro easily avoids the pinball! Effortlessly. Not even close. Oh, what an uppercut. Looking for an opening for that finisher, it seems. And that's a smart move. Just hit the finisher, get the win, and get out of there. And down he goes, thanks to a vicious gut wrench suplex. Wise move going for the stretch. Anytime a superstar sees an opening for their finisher, they got to take it, as Byron was saying. Elongating the match not only gives your opponent an opportunity to get back in it, but you're also running. Seth Rollins is looking for the decisive end. Yeah, right to the wall. Oh, Big opportunity here. Here's the cover. Digging deep for a kick out. And the match continues. Oh, man. This is all but over. Seth Rollins, what a move. Somebody wound him up, and he's off and running. No telling where or when this will end. Losing all his power to drive him to the man. Spinning kick to the gut. Look at this. Boom. Nice. Escapes trouble there. Cesaro looks like he's really struggling right now under the pressure. He started this match in great health, but now it seems fatigue has set in. That's over at this point. And here we go. Seth Rollins sees his opening. Buckle ball! The air just came out of the shoulders on the mat. And Seth Rollins picks up the win. That was an awesome win for this young man. One of the biggest of his career by far. What a battle. Respect to both competitors. And this I love. This I absolutely love. Maybe you should have taken a page out of that kid's book in your career, Corey. Great sportsmanship. I would have hit him in the mouth. We have a great matchup coming up next. gets the early advantage could take this thing to a win these guys are undoubtedly going to give us a show here tonight hooked up
Randy Orton might be the most successful third-generation wrestler in WWE history. The Orton family has been a fixture in wrestling for over 50 years, competing in main events from the 1960s all the way to today. Yeah, Cole, it all started with Randy Orton's grandfather, Bob Orton Sr., who competed in the NWA and AWA, even took on Bruno San Martino in New York City. Close line in the corner! You both started the Orton family tree with the discussion of Bob Orton Sr., but Randy's father, Cowboy Bob Orton, has an impressive pedigree, too, as a WWE superstar, including being in Roddy Piper's corner during major matches at the first two WrestleManias. Yeah, as great as his father and grandfather were, Randy brought the Orton name to even greater heights. With and a quick pin attempt by R-Truth. You're not gonna win many matches that easily. It's gonna take more than that. Randy Orton, no problem getting out of that one. His clothesline finds the mark. This is what makes him one of the best in the business. Here we go, R-Truth setting up. And here comes Orton. Ooh. Vintage Randy Orton. But he's got to capitalize now. Oh no, RKO out of nowhere! Can he finish the job? Randy Orton looking to finish this one early. And there's the kick out. Too soon. Stop pulling oh. leg snap! Oh, that's gonna hurt. Tear your hamstring. Seems to me, guys, like we're just moments away from seeing the finisher, which could obviously put this match on ice. on a mission here. Now Randy Orton seems to have lost a step or two. This match is definitely testing his metal, guys. He's really starting to look fatigued here, guys. And when that happens, your whole body starts to give out on you. He's going to need to be careful here. The finisher could absolutely... He's got the shoulders down. Gets the shoulder up. Wow. What's it going to take? Wow. That's pure power, guys. He can crank it up whenever the mood strikes him. Oh, boy. He is rolling. Amazing display of power. Orton looking for something big. Uh oh. Punishing the human body. I don't like how this is looking for our truth. No, he reverses it. This has been a war. Looking a little out of it, up on that turnbuckle. Oh, this could very well be the beginning of the end. Looks like he's pinpointing the back. He's got him covered. A kick out, and you can see the frustration starting to build. Just when you thought it was over. Wow. Here comes Archer. Maybe a figment of your imagination, but little Jimmy hurts. Here's a he goes for the cover. One, two, three. The cover, and this one's history. What a win. That was an awesome win for this young man. One of the biggest of his career by far. What a battle. Respect to both competitors. And this I love. This I absolutely love. 
Maybe you should have taken a page out of that kid's book in your career, Corey. Great sportsmanship. I would have hit him in the mouth. 